Wow. So if me I hear on a, on a hear me I know. When I hear me, I'm gone. So if my aunt or my in or my out, what I go on? Now hear me? All right. Somebody said the sound sound good there. Yeah. Greetings in the name of the Most High Queen Celestia Ija. A long time in a command. Wicked Tisha, how you do? Yeah. I mean, I come on a long time from what you car. Don't know me busy, I do me something. Yeah. Play music and I go on with myself. We got the promoters and the organizers of Yosh. What an event. Don't know. My first time playing a Yosh. Big up on myself, Yosh promoter. Yeah. Great Ashile man. Wicked and wild. Don't know the 31st of December. You don't know I shall present suits on a Duns River. But I feel like I know the water when I go on the about Duns River. Then, Connecticut people, I come and foreign next year, I swear. I look out. Big up on yourself. Classic queen, I know you're cold and ball. I know you're over Canada and ball. Big up yourself. Star man snow me see over there. Eh. Two me not come on come me on all a little talk. Don't know it go Mandeville people. Don't know. Saturday night me come bun fire down there. A party when him El Fuego. Yeah. Oh spice coming along. Spice coming along fine. Don't know me yet. Chandel over Atlanta. Wah go on three thirty seven wicked lander. Come a Jamaica and look for me. Me hate you just to me a grow that's why you diss me all the while. Wah go on Angola people them. Jesus Christ over Angola. Angola nice enough people. Big up Angola people them. Left Jamaica and go over Angola go build it up and nice it up and sweet it up. Yeah. Well you care. I don't know me out there for New Year's Eve. Elegant and class. The place to be Cavendish Ballroom or Cavendish Banqueting Suite. Big up Nico. I don't know. Big up to the promoter there. I'm a brother of that. Big party every year. The New Year's Eve. Elegant and class featuring Richie Feelings. Antigua. Jesus Christ. The 17th of this month. Me over there, live and direct. Who na hear me yet? Hear me live and direct. Spice I recover nicely, man. Don't worry on yourself. Spice all right. Spice is okay. She I recover. But I know that me really come on for come telling no about. I come to tell no about myself. My nice. I may have tell on yourself not to love on yourself, people. Because I realize enough how I live on a life to please everybody and not please on yourself. It's okay to take a time out and love by yourself. Praise yourself. Cherish yourself and celebrate yourself and big up yourself. Because I may have telling you this. So if you wait for people to big you up, you're not getting a big up. And the people where you expect big up from, they're not going to give up. You will never get it. Because you have a lot of people. In other society, in you know, other life, where we live right now, them cheer for you until them actually see say we are reached somewhere. When them see say we are reached somewhere, them time they all type of mouth start shoo out, all type of words start chirp out in the ear. You start hear all kind of things, and then you go look in yourself and I say, "Oh, that person, you have to say them love me and did a cheer for me," and then them stop cheer for you. Some people just start cheer for you because. Them think you're going to stop. You see me? Enough people cheer for you at the start, you know, but I know the end result they're going to look for. They might expect you to give up. They might expect you to stop. 
enough people just there in your life for you want to say, then I wish you a wait pan, I wear my wait pan for just stop the way I do. You know them style, eh? What a person they are wait pan. You see what me I say? When you say, what me take my own, my own advice? Yeah, man, me advise myself all the while, man. That the one thing me always do, you know, because I remember, you know, enough beat, we get, you know, and we hold it and fight it the same way, because we can't be business with people, say. Me that business with people, say. Or I worry about what people, say. We don't come on from the internet. We don't hide ourselves and take ourselves a long time. Me have to remember, say, I saw life got people that are failure. You see me? People that are failure. I have to meet some people along the way where they are going to mean you good, but to how some people beat you and deal with your wicked, they are not even going to know if them people are mean you good. Because I have some people come to you genuinely with love and celebration and some whole heap of nice things, but you see, through some other people, there are some wickedness, it's like you just said, you know. All them people are dealing with me, so. All them people are come to me and I come dealing with me, so nice. Mine only are dealing with me too nice, you know. Because it's like some other people they come and deal with their nice and then when they deal with their nice, it's like them just switch by you and just make it look like say you're the worst thing. See? So I just say, go and celebrate on yourself. Because all of the teacher them we have got to a struggle right now and feel like you won't give up because Pitney has stressed you out, your man has stressed you out, your woman has stressed you out, your husband or your wife has stressed you out. You can't, but sometimes you just feel like say you, you want to give up because you are alone. Lone place, it will come out of your pay. And when you look at your pay, because remember, say, through it will come through the bank, your pay just go away. So you never buy ice water, you throw it your pay, not even a bottle of water. And your, and your, and your pay done, and you say, Janome, I can't deal with this. So you don't know opportunity come but once, you know. So when you get opportunity, you have to just take it because you're not lucky enough you to get one and two and three and four opportunities. You see me? You have to just hold it. Pick up yourself, Stephanie. Or Steffi. Pick up yourself. We have to know for all it more time. Pick up all these small business people, them where you are trying and not get too hype and get ahead of yourself. You are dealing with business. Because you have some people, them don't know how to do business. They have a little online store and them disrespect a whole heap of people because the people they message them and they ask them questions. Let me tell you this. Once you have a business, people are going to deal me and they are going to ask you how much for this and how much for that. You have to have the patience to deal with them. And not because you have 13,000 followers now or you have 20,000 followers now, you feel like you're more than the people. Them. Remember, say it start from no followers. You understand? It's just like one time we were on Facebook and the time was with friend. Zin, remember the time was with friend first and then we go to the we start get be a friend after that. So just don't go and like you better than nobody, because nobody no more than nobody, and nobody no better than nobody. You see me? Sometimes we get ahead of ourselves too much. Nothing wrong if you're proud of yourself and big up yourself. Nothing wrong. But we have to always remember, say, everybody means something. Everybody has value. They might not have no value to you, but they have value to somebody else. Because if me message you, and I want a shoes, or I want the drapes, then I see you put up on your page. I mean, because I'm going to message you, no matter what time, because remember, say, once you have an online store, you never put up and say, the opening hours for the online store is 9 to 5 or 8 to, to, to 9 or whatever. As long as you have an online store, people have a message you. So if you're up, you just respond to it. You know, but I come and send the people, the people them face the message. And then you have a policy, a return policy. If you're not getting a refund, you have a return policy. Every store in the world have a return policy. Every store in the world, they have a return policy. They have no refund, but they have a return policy. Whether it's three days or four days to return the item. You understand? And that's why I found always that about people are fighting when I want to fight on the cell because when the customer service is not good. Somebody message at 12 o'clock in the night. I, I just threw a scroll and we want something for graduation or we want something for funeral or we want something for a wedding. And we see it on your page. We see it on your site. So that's why we have a message at 12 o'clock in the night. All you have to do, wait till you wake up in the morning if you don't want to answer it. Let me tell you this. You see, business and man problem and girl problem, not going to work. You can't take out your man problem and your girl problem upon the customers. Even though I'm not buying nothing yet, I'm still a customer. Because I'm inquiring to buy something from you. 
See? I'm inquiring to buy something from you. So not because you have your man problem or your girl have your problem. Me I say something to you and me I inquire about four or five items. You have to feel like, oh, if you're going to buy something, just buy something. And ray, 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 and, and then you give off your attitude. And I saw it go. Because all oh, you know things are Gucci and Louis Vuitton and Balenciaga and all of them people. They them start from which part they start from? Zin? And them have a return policy. They might do have a no refund. They have a no return policy. Enough time I see it on the internet and I see how some of the people they want to stop it. Everybody has got to choose stress. Everybody has something we are bad at them right now. And talking about stress, I just want to know right now. Everybody does count. Everybody does count because everybody works hard for their money. I don't busy that way you don't forget your money, but everybody work hard for their money. Everybody work hard for their money. You understand? And the word stress, it a go around hard. And I know a lot of you know I got you no troubles and no child and no crosses. I beg you no please. You don't have to hold it if you don't have high blood pressure. When I have to stop eat certain things and stop feel like say, drinking can solve on a problem. And a drinking can solve on a problem because when I drink boom and when I drink red bull and when I drink all kind of things and when I damage yourself more. Because remember, say, stroke can go around hard right now. Strokes can't catch anybody. Stroke can't stroke can catch the dog. You understand? It's something that can catch anybody at all. See? So I beg you to please. Man and woman take care of yourself. Anything where you can't control, you leave it alone. Because remember, when you get sick, you're going to become a problem to somebody. And everybody will say them love you. Now nah, I gotta have the time to take care of you because you are going to impede them. You are gonna turn a problem to them. You are gonna, because enough people don't understand how valuable, valuable health and strength is. You see, once you can wake up in the morning, put up your hand in the ear and stretch and go to the bathroom, go use the bathroom, you yawn, you fart, you do anything, and you just, you know, you wake up in our vibes and know when I hurt you. I want the greatest thing, it's better than money. It's better than money. I tell you, it's better than money. It's better than money. Zane? Because watch this. If you get sick right now, you don't have health insurance. And a matter of fact, even if you have health insurance, your health card only covers a certain amount of stuff. Health insurance don't cover everything. See? So, we now send a doctor bad because doctor good. But are you have to be a first doctor. See? You have to be your first doctor. You have to take care of yourself. Me and a lady I raised this man a big woman, Miss Miller. And we are member when we did younger, like she a bigger woman for me and she a member the days when time everything where I come from the earth was natural and real organic. Now them organic thing where I come now. That not organic. Where them gonna get so much things from after the, the things them they ever get no time for for grow. You remember one time when they see the fowl, them know we are tall. The fowl, them big, so. One fowl, all can we all five pound. Now, a three weeks, and fowl ready for eat. Because whatever, them are give the fowl, them. See? So, we are do damage to ourselves more than ever now. We never know. How we not go into the store and them are come talk about organic this and no sugar that and this is that and that is this. That's something that kill we, you know. Something that kill we. We are doing more damage to ourselves when we stress. See? We are doing more, we are doing more damage to ourselves. Something that kill we. The health instructor stay so. And I'm going go on, and I'm going go on. And I'm do the whole of this. And I'm say, five, four, three. And everybody will jump up and I go on and I reel up. See? And then all of a sudden, you say the health instructor is sick. What go on with the health instructor? Health instructor. Of a blood cell where busting in head. A blood vessel busting at the health instructor head. I remember this is man, you have him as the fittest man. Guy, I look at him and I say, Yo, look how the health man's strong, man. 
look upon him. See? But him stress, half things about him. Bam him guy in the yard go sleep and catch strokes. Catch all heart attack in him sleep. See? Remember say, no found they at work. Una fight with, una supervisor, una fight with, una manager, una fight with some girl when I like, una some boy we here to know. See? But I make you know, say, don't make nobody make you lose your work. At Christmas I come now. When you might get some work in a Christmas when January come and slow down and February slow down, what I go do? See? Because I know everyone we have, 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 have subject. See? But not for we have skill and just want an opportunity. Because all of the chef them, because they don't know how to cook, cooking on a skill, cooking on the art, and every day the rice are going to come shelly. Sometimes the rice are going to soft because you know, misinterpret the water, and put too much water, and then you know, try to take out back some and it not come out so the rice get all soft. Every chef goes through that problem there. Sometimes you have some meat and the meat extra tough and you're dead and you have pressure it and you have cook it for three, four hours and it not cook or you want it to cook. Everybody go through some miss up when it comes to any form of business where they do. You go to Obama and you work on a roof and you go to Obama and you put the nail up on the top so you put the nail up then it end up on a leak and you're up there for three months. See? Everybody have them problem. So you have to just sit down and not make stress kill you. Because know? when you go to Obama and need rest, you see rest is the most important thing. Rest is the most important thing. Them say you're supposed to get at least eight hours. So if you only get six hours, that is still good. But you have to make sure you get as much sleep because sleep is very important. You can't just sit down and... Because remember, enough time we are stressed and we not even know so we stress too, you know. Enough time we stress and not even know so we stress. But we are thinking about something and we not even know so, so much it a bad way. See? Enough time we don't know so things are bad way, you know. Enough time, you know, because I would have said, Jaja, and as I go through what you want to say, yeah, man, it's going to take care of. Enough for our partner, and the partner, woman, I said, why? She going to put me on blast. I say, a girl goes up on my post. Let me tell you now again. A two year, enough for we sit down and not do nothing. God bless everybody where we work right through the pandemic. A lot of us lose our work during the pandemic. A lot of us still have struggle right now, but we're in a better position than where we did in a Two years ago. Because 2020, March, everywhere locked down. See? And when we start the new year, the place did barely open, then it locked down back again. See? So, no for we. We who are all people, back up in a debt. We back up. I mean, no, so some want to do some unforeseen, some unforeseen things to get money. Remember on the moral and on the pride. You understand? Remember on the moral and on the pride. Me I beg on the do. Take care on yourself, people. Do me I beg on the take care on yourself. See? Bank are the next thing again. See it there? Lick you with overdraft. Because remember this. If you have the whole of the money one time and say you carry it back at the bank, the bank don't want it. And I feed them money, you give them back. You might tell us that they don't want it like that. You borrow 100,000 from the bank and you carry back 100,000 to give the bank. Right? They don't want it like that. They say you must bring $5,000 every month. And you say you want to pay it off and have the whole hundred. The bank say them don't make the money that way. If you bring the whole of the money back one time. See? So there's chicks and trading and everything where you're going, boy. So you go to Sabam now and did have the money and now the money burn up and you have struggle for pay it back. The same bank I call you. And I say, oh, I have money, you know. And you did just have it and I give them. You did just have it and I give them. Now... I don't know where I go on in the school system. But I read an article this morning saying that more than 7,000 children are not in the school right now. 7,000 children not going to school. Right, 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 right now. 7,000. You know what is 7,000? Remember, this is not a thousand, you know. In our Jamaica, we are talking about, you know. 7,000 children not going to school. Why are these children not in school? See, why are these children not in school? You know what the reason? No for them mother not have it. No for them father not have it. Some of the mother them have five pitney and she can afford to send to a school and she send three go beg. And she they out there and I, and I wonder if she where she can do for make ends meet. Why do you think the half pound of rice can't stop sell? Why do you think the pound of flour can't stop sell? Why do you think the half pound of sugar can't stop sell? 
Remember, every day things are raised, you know. Remember, you can't get nothing for $20 and $30 again, you know. Them days are done. So imagine, me buy a peely book them. I'm going to four, four peely book them again. And four peely book them cost $12,000. And she'll go primary school. See? Primary school she'll go. But me could afford to buy a peely book them. What happened to the other mothers then? Right? We cannot afford. Me know. Me know. It rough everywhere. See? Me know it rough. But I believe you have to make the sacrifice. And you have to make sacrifice to make your picnic. Because remember, I know the child cannot choose who are their parents. We choose which child we can take up. We choose when we want to breed a man. And we choose that. The child not choose we. We choose the child. So I believe we should do anything at all for, 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 for do the due diligence when it comes on to the child. See? Because me I look on the part program. A long time part program I go on. It I go on at the high school and it I go on in, a, in, a, in a the basic school and it I go on in a the primary school. Them. Me not blame the government. Because the government do more than what them can do. See? Where you provide for your child must be three out of four days a week and the mother provide for two. See? And instead of the mother go to man child to help the school run a part program, she run go breed again. Me look on it two different ways because probably she a child have sex to make ends meet and catch her next belly again. So me now bash the mother, you know. Don't ever think me come out and bash the mother. Me still have to look on it in a positive light. She go to man and look at thing. She say she want to get a boy the little front. Forget a little thing from him because manipulation will never stop, you know. Lack of funds cause a whole heap of things, you know. Whole heap of choices you have to make when you don't have no funds. See? So enough time when you see enough of them girls you breed and I really breed them one breed. See? Them go have sex and them now think about a condom and them something there. Them just know say them want a money for go buy them gas. Because remember you go and check enough of them get to you. Remember say girl a girl a girl you get a little front. Because a man can't afford to give her two grand or three grand. Three grand for a gas in our community a 25 pound cylinder. See? So what if a time when you go to them and you see them a breed? And I really breed, enough of them want to breed. We have to give them the benefit of the doubt. We, have, we, we, we can't quick to cast judgment upon people. We cannot quick to cast judgment on these people. We have to give them the benefit of the doubt. Because they have three pitney already. Me not think that they would have to have a fourth one. See? Well, me can say find a different way to make money. But they know it's the easiest way that for them because watch this. Enough time, you look upon it the next way too. Enough time, some of them girls don't want to work too. So, them those things that just lay upon them back and take a back as a. You know? A man come upon them and bust a juice na them. Them, them just say so them are work with. Oh, God will provide. See? But I believe, say, if more people go upon the road and, and, and come out in their numbers and make we see how much. People now work because let me tell you this. World Cup I go on. And every time a goal score for somebody's favorite side, that show you how much people not working in Jamaica. And it's so sad. Every time a goal score in any rural part of Jamaica, any garrison, them time they realize how many men and women not working in the country. It's a lot. Because when the match them come on, it's supposed to be work time. See? And you look and you say, so wait, that's how we work do you know? Now, we are going to a time now where they might tell us, say, at the dark ages we're in. Terry, we are going through the dark ages. See? Because every time you hear somebody on the internet attack, I be a darkness, you know. Lone darkness, you know. So Tasha there said, no for one way I comment about condom and contraceptive not using. You know what I say? Alright, over the clinic. The last time you check over the clinic, you have um contraceptive. 
when them give some injection. I don't know if it's still there because remember, I don't go to clinic, so I don't know. I don't know if it's still there. But everybody have a choice. Once you have sex, anything can happen. Alright, Diane. We need to be more motivated and self-reliant. That's our biggest problem. We're not self-motivated. We are look to seek validation from the internet too much. We are not looking on the good side of the internet. We look on the mix-up side and the tear-down side. We want to check every time we want to go up on Queenie Life. We want to go up on Queenie Life and nuff it up when time mix-up and go on. See? We want to check every time we want to go up on Ivani Live and um, Pretty Dan Live and all of know. Big, the big independent people them just start a kill us. For just over life and us a list of people business. Remember, Uno are working, you know, but the other people them are over there, enough of them not working, enough of them just sit down, them beg data for watch. Remember, you know, asking for somebody, asking for data to go and make a call for get a work. You forget it. But if you go and just take your whole of your credit, for just a watch people business, I watch people business, where oh, you go, oh, you go, what that, that do for motivate you? Because enough other life, enough other life that they were. Is motivated. But you don't know them live there. You don't know them live there. See? Because if you try to reason with enough of them youth, enough of them look young girl nowadays. I want thing them to tell about choppy line, choppy line, choppy line. And everybody has to chop the line and make it, you know. Some of have to go wash car to make it. Some of have to go do delivery work to make it. Some of have to go work on um, garbage truck to make it. Some of have to go do any farm or other work more than chopping. Is Not every one of us is cut out to be a chopper. And all that we make out to be a chopper. Me never cut out to be a chopper. Me that they a prison a long time. The first somebody when me call, they me that call police for me. Me that for going to prison. And I might think that. So everybody will turn chopper and it work for no. And the next man see it. And say, yo, I want to try that. He might not so lucky. Because he said the licky licky mentality. Can watch this now. Tomorrow. A weekend. Seeing, and we're gonna see a lot of weekend millionaires coming out the woodwork. Seeing, we're gonna see a lot of weekend millionaires coming out the woodwork. You know who are the weekend millionaires? The people who go to the parties, them and act rich. And if no young youth, they pan this, and no young girls, they pan this. Always remember, take pride in our self, take pride in our own care, on our present on self to the world. Not make people perceive you, not look a dirty way. Because if you go out a road, dirty, because remember now, you know, you see the half foot, hang uh, half heel back out of slippers I go on now. And I see other people are gravitate to. It was the no belt in our pants one at the time, and people are gravitate to no belt. You know, no belt come in, no belt are when they are prison. It's a prison style. I don't know where the hang out heel back come from. I don't know where that come from. Zin, but me never gravitate to this, them things that when me I was a young youth. Eh? Me never gravitate to certain things. Remember, you know, when you leave and put on your clothes to say you go out the road, people are going to look at you. Remember when you go out, your personal hygiene is supposed to be top tier. You know if you smell like hmm, essence of a ram goat. You know if you smell like you have on frozen 2000. You're supposed to smell good even if a carbolic soap you have on. They must smell your carbolic soap. That means you hold a nice beard. You're not supposed to go out the road and you yield back dirty and you just look and stay about it and, and, and I saw it for God. See? But now, I realize that society where we, we are deal with now, nastiness is okay. I don't talk about a dumb mentality. I talk about nastiness. Because if somebody can proudly come out and say they don't like beard, you're mad. You see, you see, you can't come out and come talk about you know like beard. Oh, people, if you come out and proud of not liking to take a bath. And then now, you still have some girl glorify this guy here with saying not like beard. Right? Because she same have money. That's why I'm telling you, you say money. Money is a dangerous thing. 
Money show your people true colors. Money show your people true identity. Money and no, no, eat.